Hi there, I'm Patrick Frank, an award-winning video producer and author. I help companies turn into video-first businesses, which means adding video into all parts of their company, whether it be sales and marketing, customer success, training, and more. I put this presentation together to talk about some of the concepts in my book and to give you some examples to show you how you can start adding video into some of these things that you do in your business. So let's talk about the first uh, uh, item here, which is video follow-ups. So a video follow-up is when any sort of trigger happens, you're sending a personalized one-to-one -one video to that person. An example could be if they signed up for a trial subscription to your product or something like that. So instead of just sending them an email that says, hey, thanks for signing up, you get notified that, hey, this person signed up and you go on, pick up your phone and you send a personalized video thanking them for signing up. Why does this work? Because it's authentic, shows you care, it doesn't scale, so it's not automated, and it just gives that little extra boost of authenticity and creates an experience that's very memorable so that that person's not gonna forget what it was like when they signed up for that new product or service. Let's take a look at some examples of how you can pull this off. One of the apps I love for this is called Bonjoro, and Bonjoro works with Zapier and some other automation tools so that it'll let you know exactly when someone signs up, when someone upgrades, when any other kind of event happens, so then you can send that personalized video through the Bunjaro platform. This is another way to retain customers as well. So let's say whether they requested to cancel or they've decided not to upgrade after a trial period, you could send them an individual video and just ask them like, hey, how's it going? Would love to hear what happened. You know, we definitely want to see if this works for you. It's a great way to do that. Very simple way to do this is with a screen recorder like Loom. So when I finish a sales call, a lot of times I will go to that prospect's website or some other page that we talked about and just pull up a quick screen recorder, kind of talk through some of the things, reiterate some of the concepts that we talk about on the call and just thank them for their time. Just kind of further demonstrating my value and the ideas that I brought to the call in hopes that they um, will want to work with me. So that's a really easy way to do it as well. So one of the big concepts of my book is talking about how we can eliminate meetings by just sending videos. So let's take a look at how might that work. So I'm using this tool here called Prezi Video, which is a really cool platform to put together presentations. And a lot of times when you're presenting in a meeting, you don't need to have that immediate feedback from the people in the call. You could just send them this video and they can watch it on their own time. They can watch it at 2x speed and they can send a video reply or create some other kind of threaded conversation in another app. So how can we do this? One of my favorite tools, uh, in addition to Prezi Video, is Descript. Descript is a tool that will take a video, auto-generate a transcription, and then allow you to clip different parts of that video to create new videos, to edit certain, um, you can edit the transcript. Uh, it makes it really easy, easily shareable and searchable. And of course, this tool I'm using right here, Prezi Video. I think that as we're moving things more into virtual communication, it makes a lot of sense to be able to see your content and your face at the same time. So we don't have to choose whether we're looking at our PowerPoint slides or our face. It's all on the same platform. And I think that that's really important. One of the most simple and obvious formats for creating a video is a testimonial. So here's how you can do that. Why would you want to do a testimonial? Well, a testimonial is great because a potential customer watches this video and sees themselves in this client of yours that had a great experience. So it's a really great way to feature your ideal clients and attract other clients like them. So let's take a look how we can do this. Next time you're on a Zoom call, hit the record button when you're talking to a client or someone that, that knows you well, and just ask them, hey, what's it like working with me? What was that project like? Hey, that thing that we just finished, I would love to ask you a couple questions about it. So at the end of this call that you're already having, you can just take five minutes, maybe 10 minutes, and just ask them about how the project went. You would just record it on Zoom, drop it into Descript, one of the tools I talked about, or other kinds of video editing, simple video editing tools, find that little relevant segment, and you can post that, put it on your website, put it anywhere you want. So that's a really easy way to be able to get a testimonial without having to uh, schedule anything additional because you're already having that call. Another way to do it if you really want to up your game is with a platform called Riverside. Riverside is a high quality Zoom alternative so we use this when we're doing any kind of remote interviews. What I really love about this is that each participant that we're talking to, so we can have a panel discussion of four people, um, every person is recorded on their own separate video track. 
So then in the back end, we go and we download them and we can do all kinds of different fun post-production stuff with it. We can create different layouts, um, different picture in picture and uh, fix anyone's audio problems. So it really gives us a ton of flexibility because each participant is recorded on a separate track, which is really helpful. So those are some ideas for ways that you can get started with a video first business. My book is called Zoom Out, the video first playbook. It's out anywhere books are sold, and I would love to hear from you and see the kind of videos that you're making. Cheers.